Hey there, it's Cheryl, mental toughness coach, published author, speaker, and mother of a couple of great kids who happen to now be high school and college division one student athletes. Now, over the next couple of weeks, I'm very excited because I'm going to start sharing some habits of world-class performers. And the amazing thing is, is that teens can learn them. As a matter of fact, adults can learn them too. So keep your ears open because we're going to challenge parents and coaches as well. So what we're going to start with today for our number one world-class habit, and it's titled Rule Your Morning. Now keep in mind that all teens have had those mornings. As a matter of fact, I've had those mornings where you wake up a little bit late and everything is just a little bit crazy. And you know what? It sets the stage for having an unproductive and actually tiring day. So it's not the best way to get started. So if teens can learn a couple world-class habits of how to rule their morning, then they'll be ready to set the stage for a fantastic day. Now, of course, I'm not gonna to talk too much about sleep because everyone has heard so much about that from me all the time, but in order to rule your morning, teens need to rule their evening and their bedtime. So that's incredibly important. I know it's rough sometimes with high school, so that hopefully it's the exception instead of the rule with them staying up very late. And if they do have to stay up late, maybe they can have a little rest or a nap or something when they get home just something to re-energize them. Now, here are the three tips. And keep in mind, I know teens are very busy. These are not gonna take more than a few minutes and they can really set the stage for them to have a world-class day. That way they can study their best, practice their sport or whatever extracurricular they're doing and really feel good about their day. Now, the first thing is when they get up, it's amazing if they can stretch or move around just to get the body woken up a little bit. Doesn't have to be anything too complicated. If they're used to exercising in the morning, which most teens, at least the one that I've talked to, they don't. But if they get up and go for a run or something before uh, they get ready for their day, then that's great. But if not, just take a couple minutes to get up and stretch a little bit. Then the second thing is, is to have a glass of water, just plain water. Eight to 12 ounces is great because teens tend not to hydrate enough. And it's very important that they do that because it has a direct correlation to brain function and immunity and all those things. So if they can get up, have a little stretch, have a big glass of water, then they're off to a good start. Now the third thing, and this one is so important for them to get in this habit, and this habit that they can take with them through high school, college, and beyond. The third thing and that has to do with these world-class habits is to be still and breathe. So in other words, they get up, they stretch, they have a glass of water, and they take literally 10 or 15 seconds to just be in the room by themselves when it's quiet and take some deep breaths in through their nose and out through their mouth. Five deep breaths and just to try and be calm. And if they have anything on their mind when they exhale, they can just think of it moving out of the way. So if they can just be still and breathe in the morning just for a few seconds, that can really set the stage for their day being more productive and for them to be more calm. So if you found these three tips useful, I encourage you to share on Facebook. Also, I am here for you and or your teen. Please do reach out to me. I'm glad to take any questions or comments or meet with you and your teen if I can help in any way. Thanks so much for watching. I look forward to seeing you next time.